Curious about which vehicles are the strongest in the Iraqi ground forces? What tough machines lie in their arsenal? And can they compete with some of the most advanced militaries in the world? Well, today we'll find out together, showcasing the top 10 most powerful military vehicles of the Iraqi army. In this list, we'll focus solely on land vehicles, leaving warships and aircrafts for future rankings. But what do you think is the most powerful military vehicle in the Iraqi army, and why? Let us know in the comment, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see much more rankings of the best military machines in the world. And now, let's, let's get started. Number 10 EE-9 Cascabel the EE-9 Cascabel is a Brazilian six-wheeled armored reconnaissance vehicle developed in the 1970s by Engisa to replace the outdated M8 Greyhound fleet. Initially armed with the Greyhound's 37mm gun, it was later upgraded with a more powerful 90mm Cockerel cannon, significantly boosting its firepower. The Cascabel features a crew of three, a commander, driver, and gunner. Its 5.2-liter Detroit diesel engine produces 212 horsepower, providing solid performance across challenging terrains. With a weight of 12 tons, it strikes a balance between mobility, protection, and firepower. The Cascavel's versatility and rugged design have made it an essential asset in Iraq's military, offering effective reconnaissance and support capabilities in a range of combat environments. Number 9, M113. The M113 is a fully tracked armored personnel carrier developed by FMC Corporation, first introduced to the U.S. Army in 1961 to replace the older M59 APC. It gained prominence during the Vietnam War, where it became the most widely used armored vehicle by the U.S. forces. Its durable design allowed it to break through dense jungle and engage enemy positions effectively. The M113 is made from 5083 aluminum alloy, offering protection with armor thickness ranging from 28 to 44 millimeters. Powered by a Detroit diesel engine producing 275 horsepower, it can carry a crew of two along with 11 to 15 passengers. The vehicle's primary weapon is the M2 Browning machine gun, but it can be outfitted with a variety of secondary armaments depending on mission needs. The M113's combination of mobility, protection, and versatility has ensured its long service life in many countries, including Iraq. Number 8. BTR-94 The BTR-94 is a Ukrainian amphibious armored personnel carrier, an advanced modification of the Soviet-era BTR-80. Designed for versatility in combat, the BTR-94 weighs 13.6 tons and accommodates a crew of three, along with up to 10 passengers. Its primary firepower comes from twin 23 by 152 mm 2 A7M cannons, providing substantial offensive capability, while a 7.62 mm PKT machine gun serves as its secondary weapon. Powered by a 300 horsepower diesel engine, the BTR-94 is capable of traversing both land and water with ease making it ideal for amphibious missions. Although its armor specifications are classified, the vehicle offers solid protection for its occupants in a variety of operational environments. The BTR-94's ability to swiftly deploy and support infantry units, combined with its firepower and amphibious nature, make it a valuable asset for modern militaries, including those in the Middle East, where it has seen use in Iraq's armed forces, Number 7, BMP-3. The BMP-3 is a Soviet and Russian infantry fighting vehicle designed as a successor to the BMP-1 and BMP-2. It weighs 18.7 tons and can carry 380 kilograms of ammunition, a crew of three along with up to seven infantry soldiers, plus two additional seats for extra personnel. The BMP-3 is well-armed, featuring a 100mm 2A70 cannon, a 30mm 2A72 autocannon, and optional Cornet EM anti-tank missiles when equipped with the Barajac turret. Its secondary armament includes three 7.62mm PKT machine guns. The vehicle is protected by a combination of aluminum alloy and steel armor with 35mm of frontal protection. 
Powered by a 500 horsepower UTD 29M diesel engine, the BMP3 is capable of high mobility and amphibious operations, making it a versatile platform in modern combat. Number 6. Astros 2 MLRS The Astros 2 is a self-propelled multiple rocket launcher developed by the Brazilian company Avabras. Known for its modular design, the system can launch rockets with calibers ranging from 127 mm to 450 mm, offering remarkable versatility. Weighing 10,000 kg, the Astros 2 is operated by a crew of three and is capable of firing rockets with a maximum range of 30 to 300 km, depending on the model. Its primary armament is the Universal Multiple Launcher Module, while a 12.7 mm M2 Browning machine gun provides secondary defense. Powered by a Mercedes 8-cylinder diesel engine delivering 280 horsepower, the Astros 2 is a powerful and flexible artillery system widely used in several countries for long-range artillery support in area saturation. Number 5. T-72 Lion of Babylon The T-72 Lion of Babylon is an Iraqi variant of the Soviet T-72 main battle tank. During the early stages of the Iran-Iraq War, Iraq imported T-72 tanks from the Soviet Union and Poland, which later saw action in both the Gulf War and the Iraq War. In the 1980s, Iraq established a local factory to retrofit and repair these tanks, launching the Lion of Babylon project to assemble T-72s domestically. Weighing 41.5 tons, the tank has a crew of three and features armor that ranges from 45 to 300 millimeters. Its main armament is a 125 millimeter 2 A46M smoothbore cannon, supplemented by a 7.62 millimeter PKT coaxial machine gun and either a 12.7 millimeter NSVT or DSHK anti-aircraft machine gun. Powered by a 780 horsepower V12 diesel engine, the T-72 Lion of Babylon provides solid battlefield performance, though it struggled against more advanced Western tanks during conflicts. Number 4. Type 83 The Type 83 is a 152mm self-propelled howitzer developed for the People's Liberation Army of China. Introduced in the 1980s, it was designed by Factory 674 and is built on a track chassis for enhanced mobility across difficult terrains. Weighing 30 tons, the Type 83 has a crew of five and features a fully traversable 360-degree 152mm howitzer as its main armament, supported by a 12.7mm anti-aircraft machine gun for additional defense. Powered by a WR-4B-12 V150LB 12-cylinder diesel engine producing 520 horsepower, it has a top speed of 55 km per hour and an operational range of 450 km. Its torsion bar suspension provides stability on uneven ground, making it a versatile artillery system for long-range fire support in both offensive and defensive operations. Number 3. M109 The M109 is an American 155mm self-propelled howitzer introduced in the early 1960s to replace the M44. It has undergone several upgrades over the decades, with the latest variant being the M109A7. This artillery system is widely used as the primary indirect fire support weapon for maneuver brigades in armored and mechanized infantry divisions. Weighing 27.5 tons, it features a fully traversable turret that can rotate 360 degrees. The M109's main armament is the M126155 mm howitzer, capable of firing up to 28 rounds. It uses separate loading with bag charges and has an interrupted screw bridge. The rate of fire is up to four rounds per minute for short bursts and one round per minute for sustained fire. The M109 can achieve a maximum firing range of 40 kilometers with the Excalibur round. Its secondary armament includes a .50 caliber M2 machine gun. Number 2. T-90S The T-90S is a third-generation Russian main battle tank, developed as an advanced version of the T-72 
to offer enhanced capabilities on the modern battlefield. Weighing 46.5 tons, it is equipped with a powerful 125mm 2A46M-2 smoothbore gun, which can fire up to 42 rounds. The tank features a comprehensive fire control system with the 1A45T and a gunner's thermal sight for improved targeting accuracy. For protection, the T90S employs a combination of steel and composite armor, Contact 5 explosive reactive armor, and the Stora infrared jamming system to counter anti-tank guided missiles. It also has smoke grenade dischargers for additional defensive measures. Powered by the V92S 212-cylinder diesel engine, delivering 1,000 horsepower, the T90S combines substantial firepower, advanced protection, and high mobility, making it a formidable presence in modern armored warfare. The unit cost was approximately $4.5 million in 2016. Number 1. M1A-1 Abrams The M1 Abrams is a third-generation American main battle tank developed by Chrysler Defense and named after General Crichton Abrams. Designed for advanced armored warfare, it is one of the heaviest tanks in service, weighing nearly 66.8 metric tons. The M1 Abrams introduced several groundbreaking technologies, including a multi-fuel turbine engine, sophisticated Chobham composite armor, and a computer-based fire control system. The initial M1 models were equipped with a 105mm M68 gun, but later variants, including the M1A1, are armed with a 120mm Rheinmetall L44 gun, known as the M256, which can fire up to 40 rounds. The tank is powered by a Honeywell AGT-1500 multi-fuel turbine engine, generating 1,500 shaft horsepower, allowing for exceptional mobility and performance. With a unit cost of approximately $4.3 million and about 100 units in service, the M1 Abrams remains a cornerstone of U.S. Armored Forces. And there you have it, folks. These were the 10 strongest military vehicles of the Iraqi Ground Forces. Did your vehicle make the list? Write it down in the comment. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see much more rankings like this.